Hey, what's going on? It's your boy Rico, and I'm back with another video. It is August 2nd, 2020, and I'm about to drop some of the latest facts about these this second round of stimulus checks that we've all been waiting for. So I'm going to address two questions that I've seen asked quite commonly throughout every video that I've watched or not even video, just anything that I've seen. Um, we Everybody want to know how soon we going to get them how much we're going to qualify for when they come out. I'm going to give you all the latest facts, and this information is accurate as of August 2nd, 2020. So what it says is that the schedule for sending out another round of direct payments is in question until the terms of the next economic relief package are agreed upon by Washington lawmakers. Only after a bill becomes law can the IRS coordinate another sending another check. Sorry. And that means playing the waiting game for how long, though? OK, so what it's saying is, is basically it. There's a deadline. August 7th is the deadline and they have to reach an agreement by then. Then it's just a, a waiting game from there. So um, some potential dates for when they can go out is. I'm seeing here the week of August 24th and the week of September 28th. Now, don't quote me. I'm not saying this is just the most accurate updated information. OK, now. And the, and the question, I'm sorry, isn't even who would get the second one. It's more so uh, how much uh, each person would qualify. And so. It basically says the the Hills Act offers an upper limit of twelve hundred per qualified person, but that doesn't mean you'll be able to get it all. Your tax filing basically helps determine your share, among other things. The first stimulus left out child dependents who were seventeen or older and u university college students under twenty four. Uh, the plan would include five hundred for dependents, regardless of age, such as children and adults. You claiming your your taxes basically. The calculations, they can be a little tricky based on the details of your 2019 taxes, like adjusted gross income, whether you filed a single married head of household, anything like that. We can't say for sure that these are going to be the figures, but it's just based on the calculations of the last one. And if the, the, this current act was to pass as is, then this was what we, we would be looking at. So it, it, it kind of gives us four different scenarios. And the first scenario is of course, this person, right? If this person filed their 2019 taxes, which of course they did, if they filed single, if they made under $80,000, if they had no dependents under 17 and no dependents over 17, then they would be looking at about 950 bucks. And that's that's once again, these are just loose calculations. Scenario two. If you filed your 2019 taxes and you filed head of household and you made less than one hundred and forty thousand. Then your check would be. 1325 basically 1325 next scenario highlights somebody who maybe didn't file their 2019 taxes they filed married they made less than 130,000 they have two dependents under the age of 17 then it their calculator shows 3400 and that's the same for scenario number four, someone who maybe didn't file their 2019 taxes, filed married, also made less than 130,000, have a de have two dependents under 17, two dependents over 17, they will qualify for 4,400. So once again, these aren't these aren't exact numbers. We can't take these numbers to the bank. These this is just calculations, and the, this is the most accurate information that we have online as of august 2nd 2020 so let me know what y'all think in the comments man uh this is you know what this is crazy honestly i never in a million years even thought that a stimulus was possible i was really surprised when when the first stimulus came because i, I just never thought it was possible i didn't think that the government would really give everybody you know free money and i know some people are going to say well it isn't free money but 
you know, to me, somebody who has, I've had to, to hustle and grind for every dollar I got. So it just feels free to me. So let me know in the comments what y'all think, man. Also, to my core subscribers, I want to thank y'all again for rocking out with me. Tomorrow, I'm, I was writing a script when I seen this new information come in. That's what made me jump on here and, and, and do this. But I'm going to start making, I'm going to get back into the regular flow. Uh, I'm not going to, my channel is not going to become a commentary channel. So don't, don't worry. Um, I'm getting back into the flow and the regular flow of my videos. Uh, unless y'all like this more, let me know if y'all like this more, but I'm getting back into the regular flow of my videos and I'm actually going to, since stimulus is the talk of the town right now, we're going to go through some different scenario scenarios on if we used our stimulus check to start whatever business. So let me know what y'all think about that in the comments, man. It's your boy Rico. I'm signing off, man. Love everybody out there. Y'all let me know in the comments how I did. And also, like always, if you like my content, please don't hesitate to like, comment, and subscribe. It would mean the world. I'm trying to grow. Let's get it.